Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Clanola Beach Volleyball, the strange, strange little game that's really quite fun. Uh, <laughs> and hard. I've almost managed to beat the AI in exhibition mode. Almost. I got... I lost 11 to 12 just a moment ago, so... I'm not too out of practice after not playing this game for two weeks, so all is well. But, you know who we're gonna start out as this time? Actually, I never did look at the stats. I was curious as to who was better at fainting. Yeah, Lane Grant's actually pretty good at fainting. I wasn't taking advantage of that. They both have z basically zero attack. That's great. But, you know who does have good attack? We have guns. Well, Chippo worked out pretty well for us. Who had almost maximum attack. So, naturally... Uh, faint. Basically not. So naturally that ought to work out a little bit better. My god, Tats receives that is amazing. She can basically jump on the ball from anywhere. Guns, that's not really gonna happen with. I gotta win. Hey, I might have mixed feelings on the, his voice in this game, I'm not sure, but, uh, anyways, who are we gonna play with? I don't know if Garland's the type of dude I want to be with. Yeah, I don't want to have two new characters, actually, starting off immediately. Who would I make? Who would Guns be with? Like, no one feels right. You could have a, uh, let's have a Nemco Cross Capcom duo. Because I, I think they might, uh... I gotta win. No, they're well. Yeah, they don't really make up for each other's differences at all. Whatever. Okay. So Guns, Guns is a pretty fun dude. He's probably my favorite character in the series. Um, assuming that you only consider his, assuming that you only consider his heroes incarnation, I guess. But that seems to be the Let's most popular going. incarnation, anyways. This game's definitely based off his hero's appearance. And No Crest Capcom is very well, definitely based off of the little heroes as well. Huh, does he, is the time different? Does he not jump as high? Because I, no I was having no problem serving at all just a moment ago. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna have to get used to his jumping and whatnot. I will have, try to have it be known that. The AI in this game for... Yeah, he doesn't jump like I'm used to. I'm, I was playing as Tatch just a moment ago. She would jump everywhere. And Guns does not jump like that. I need to get that, have these gun stuff right in the back, dude. But, let me know that... <laughs> what?! The... Level 2 AI in this game is... Yeah, there we go. Really tough. On uh, next mission mode. Like, it's probably about as hard as the, uh... Garland Nihatom match. It's kind of odd. It's, it's harder than I thought it would be. Yeah, though, Guns, when he, when he hits the ball hard, he hits it hard. Like, a, you just need to be able to set up a hit ball with him. Why? Like, why is this what's happening? Yeah, that's nice. I look forward to managing to set up some nice shots with Guns. I assume I do manage it, of course. Yeah, I, I'm happy that they have that timing down. I have like I a feeling I'm gonna get lots of aces. Oh, guys, come on! At least let me have the pleasure of. Yeah, there we go. So I need to hit a little bit softer this time. Get nice and soft. Come on, you jerks! I don't really have the satisfaction of doing a job. So, Guns, he's appeared in a couple... He's kind of appeared in a couple games, I guess. You would say that outside of this game, he's appeared in only two, actually. So, not the m biggest resume that he has. Yay. Wait. But how does it... Oh, I see. It's points don't add up because, well... Yeah, why don't the points add up? to 10. Anyways. So Guns debuted in Dream Champ Tournament, where he had a odd-looking six-shooter. Let's get going. Okay. It looked really dumb on his back. They just kind of hoisted around everywhere. Never got to see him in action or anything like that, or his voice. This is the only game he's been voicing English in, or voicing anything other than Japanese. 
Is the Armin voice as a native language, if you want to assume that he speaks Montana or whatever? If you want to call the language? That was beautiful. I want to see the power. Oh, is the flip necessary, guns? That's a nice little style. Also, I want to see his uh, taunts, actually. Uh, it's kind of hard to get the taunts off in this game. A lot of stuff's happening. Come on, guys! I want to. I want to try it somewhere. No, just give me a chance. And now I get to switch. Oh no! Ah! Yeah, I need to be less aggressive to give it a chance to let me use mine. Come on, guys! Please. Indeed. There we go. I swear, Moo! You are useless! Anyways, Guns won't appear again until Kanoi Heroes. And that was the only other game he appeared on, if you don't count this one. He's just gotten a lot of attention as far as Kanoi Heroes characters go, because Kanoi Heroes has made a bit of a splash, I guess, since it was what the appearance of Clone characters in Namco Cross Capcom was based off of. Which meant that Jenga also got some nice screen time, which I look forward to seeing if I ever see a playthrough of that game. But, as a whole, Guns hasn't Let's actually gone okay. much in the way of appearances in this game compared to some of the characters. In fact, even Chipples had as many appearances as Guns has. And Chipple's kind of... I always felt, at least, like that this was kind of an obscure character. Oh my god! They're all useless. I need, I need to not be serving as guns. That's what needs to happen. I need to have Kano be the one served so that Guns is on that. I need to see the dot though. Darn it, camera! I turned too hard. So, yeah, I can't. If I hit the ball too hard, I can't see what Guns is doing. Darn it, man. There's one. That here is kind of pretty. Thank you for that kind of There's one. There's another. Rather. Not one, it's another. So I think that's all of them. In case you're curious about seeing them. Okay, so I'll, I'll give you a nice week hit. That wasn't what I was trying to do, but okay. Sure. I was kind of more playing on letting Guns shoot everyone up, but whatever. So it is interesting that Guns has such a prolific status. It also had an appearance in the very, very brief. Or a webcomic, Dream Traveler knocked a soul, for that matter. The never been a particularly nice character, though. <laughs> and he was just kind of a prick in Dream Jet Tournament, and very, uh, well, shall we say, <laughs> peculiar, questionable character in <laughs> Clonoa Heroes, I'll say that much. You can watch my Clonoa Heroes play through yourself if you want to see that, but. Anyways, that will be it for this episode, however, of Let's Play Kanoa Beach Volleyball. I do apologize if these uh, episodes have gone kind of short, because of the way I break them up. Since I break them up by, uh, 
having two episodes per uh, character. But it seems best this way. I want. I do want to stretch out this let's play just a little bit, just so I can hang on to playing this game every now and then for a little while longer. I'm enjoying it like this. So that will be it for subsequent play Klonoa Beach Volley. I'll see you guys next time. Next episode, when we finish off Guns and see what his ending is, and see what. I don't know who we're gonna face off against next. Actually, if it's Guns, it's gonna be really weird. But we'll see. Either way, we're gonna hear Guns theme, so it's gonna be nice. See you guys. See you, Klonoa Heroes. <laughs>